War is on and this time it's not about oil, gas or money. It's about who constructs the tallest building in the world. From the ancient Egyptian pyramids to the modern super tall skyscrapers, we have always strived to build higher and higher. All thanks to innovations, technology and architecture. Buildings are now taller than ever before. However, reaching the 1000 meter height is still far away and a dream which has to come true. You are watching Luxury Peak and in today's video, we are going to look at three failed attempts to surpass the tallest skyscraper in the world, Burj Khalifa, which is 829 meters long. So let's get started and dive into the details. The Jidda Tower Let's talk about the project which was meant to be finished this year, Jidda Tower, which was previously known as the Kingdom Tower. It will be a mega boost to the Jidda economic city with its commercial and residential facilities, rising up to 1 km tall. Once completed, this mega structure will steal the throne of tallest building in the world and this skyscraper will serve as a symbol of modernization of the desert state of Saudi Arabia. It's not an easy job to build the tallest building in the world. So it has a backing of massive architectural, political and economical giants. Its construction was started back in 2013 and the estimated time of completion was set to 63 months with a little bit of expected delays. But men can never know what will happen next day. So it has happened with this skyscraper. Along with massive labor issues, two of the most important persons behind the project and investment of this mega structure, Prince Al Walid bin Talal and Bakir bin Laden, were arrested on corruption charges when Saudi Arabian purge wave came back in 2017. Although both of them were released after some months, but behind this freedom there were some agreements with Saudi government that most of their projects and property will be owned by Saudi Arabian government. The construction was stopped in January 2018. Apparently, the contractor Saudi Bin Laden Group could not acquire the fund to keep the construction moving. At the time of stopping, the tower was already risen to 252 meters and the number of floors have reached 60. Since then, there hasn't been any progress so far. The construction was scheduled to restart in February 2020, one administration posted a video on official Twitter page. The footage included the image of tower with the words, which in 2030, Kingdom of Saudi Arabia. So it seems that now it will be completed in 2030, which is a decade away. Let's wait for 10 years and see whether it will be completed or not. Jeddah Tower will be a crown jewel of Jeddah Economic City, a commercial and residential project of 57 million square feet, featuring homes, hotels, offices, as well as tourist attractions. In this city, Jeddah Skyscraper will take a gross floor area of 2.6 million square feet, with over 252 stories and highest observation deck in the world, with 664 meters off the ground. Additionally, with the high-tech latest technology, elevators will take you to the highest floor in one minute, from where you can experience the beautiful view of the city. The building will feature a five-star four-season hotel, residential and office spaces, and luxury concordiums. At that much height, the tower has to deal with some other things too. So to overcome the obstacle of wind, the Jeddah Tower will change its shape every few floors and the LED lights on the exterior will give the Jeddah Tower a marvelous look. Number 2. Dubai Creek Tower Creek Megatall Tower construction started at 8 km away from the tallest building of the world, Burj Khalifa. So Dubai intends to defeat its own title of being the home of world's tallest building. This skyscraper will be a centerpiece of their new project which is named as Dubai Greek Harbor, a new district in Dubai, and it will be three times the size of downtown Dubai. Covering an area of 6 square kilometers, its actual official height is not confirmed yet, but it is expected to reach between 1000 and 1350 meters, minimum 150 meters tall than the Burj Khalifa. 
Despite its immense height, the structure would have just 20 floors, housing, observation decks, restaurants, and a hotel. This project was started in February 2016 by MR Properties, and the designer was world-renowned Spanish engineer Santiago Calatrava. He claims that the inspiration of this design was due from the natural form of lily, a plant which is found in desert areas. But other opinion is that this mega structure looks more like a rocket, ready for takeoff after releasing the anchor cables. What are your thoughts about this shape? Write down in the comments below. The structure of the bike rack tower will be supported by a steel cable connected to anchors on the ground, which will help in stability of the tower. Regardless of a slender stem in tower, there is an elongated oval-shaped structure near the tip of the tower which is larger than stem and resembles like a bud of a lily. There are several usable floors in this bud. Most of them will be used as an observation deck, which would provide a 360-degree view of the city. Although construction of the Bay Greek Tower has started in 2016 and builders on complete the 75-meter deep foundation till May 2017 with massive amount of concrete, which was almost equal to half of the weight of one World Trade Center tower. Moreover, its construction was stopped in late 2018 and then officially stopped in April 2020 due to the pandemic, which gives power to the rumors that the project may be cancelled. But developers strongly denied this news and insisted that the tower will be completed by 2022. This project was estimated to cost $1 billion, but with the global pandemic and fallen prices of oil, it seems that it will cost more than the estimated cost. Interestingly, this project will not likely be recognized as the world's tallest building, because according to the Council of Tall Buildings, at least 50% of the height must be habitable. But for the Dubai Creek Tower, less than 30% of the height will have habitable floors, leaving this title of tallest building controversial. Before heading to number 1, if you are enjoying the video, make sure to smash that like button and share it with your mega structure lover friends. Number 1. The Burj Mubarak Al Kabir This war of tallest building in the world revolves in Middle Eastern countries. So let's take a look to another Arabian country who is in the race of building the tallest skyscraper in the world, Kuwait, who is planning to build a skyscraper of 1,001 meter tall. Like Dubai Harbour project, Kuwait is building city naming Madinatul Harir outside of the main city on desert, and Burj Mubarak Al Kabir will be the centerpiece of that project, with other amenities with a total cost of $86 billion. This $7 billion Mubarak Al Kabir Tower will have three interlocked towers that support the overall structure. These towers pinwheel about a triangular central shaft for maximum support and it will rise up to the exact 1,001 meter because it's a reference to aquatic folk tale 1001 Arabian Nights. Each blade of this tower twists at 45 degree and expands slightly at the top, creating more usable spaces as compared to the other mega tall structures. To dissipate high attitude, wind that could blow at 150 miles per hour, the Mubarak Al Kabir will see the first architecture deployment of vertical ailerons. The normal horizontal flaps air and passenger see on plane's wing edge that help counter the wind disturbances. They will look like continuous ribbons running vertically along the six leading edges of the three blades. Because they are moving constantly, sunlight will glint off their surfaces, adding a gentle reflection to the edges of the blade that will add dynamic sparkle to the tower. The building will be composed of seven vertical spaces containing hotel, offices, residential and entertainment venues. The details of the project are mesmerizing, but unfortunately, construction hasn't been started yet. The project is on proposal stage since 2007, and we can only speculate whether record-sharing skyscraper will ever be completed. 
The plan of this silk city also includes a bridge that will eventually link Madinatul Harir with Kuwait city, which sits across a bay from the planned location of Madinatul Harir. Every country is suffering from pandemic and economies are striving. As a result, all of the three mega tall skyscrapers are on hold, giving crown of the tallest skyscraper in the world back to Burj Khalifa. Will ever these structures be completed? Do you want them to complete and see those mega tall towers in front of you? What are your thoughts about it? That's it for today's video of world's tallest skyscraper failure. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to smash the like button and subscribe for more expensive and luxurious videos like this. And if you have any video ideas, let me know in the comments below. And don't forget to watch another expensive video right here. Bye bye.